After the 2010 football season was over, everyone thought it was going to be another heated QB competition. But Stephen Three made a huge life decision. He removed himself from the team. We sat down with him for an exclusive interview. Throughout his football career, Stephen Three threw for touchdowns and made countless headlines. Now it falls to Stephen Three. But nothing he did on the field sent shockwaves through the ASU community like his decision to retire from football. Three stepped away from the game he loves because of the lingering effects of concussions. When we sat down to talk about his decision, Threed had to wear sunglasses. He says it's just one of the many symptoms of his concussions. You know, when it's nice and bright out here in Arizona, it's beautiful, I love it, but uh, but yeah, if it if it if I'm out here for a long time for practice and whatnot, it's better to have sunglasses on. Threed says he's surprised at how long it's taken to recover. You know, I'm still here three months, almost four months out, experiencing symptoms, you know, headache every day and still difficult to sleep, so. Uh, that's that's the biggest thing. They've just been pretty constant since uh, since it happened in November. The senior quarterback made the decision to retire after his fourth concussion. Stephen Three still hasn't moved since trying to recover from that last hit. My first one and my third one happened one week, and I, I played the very next week. So in that situation, you kind of treat it like an ankle sprain when when really it's much more serious. And the fourth one really scared you. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. It, I mean, that's the best way to put it. It really did, you know. Having having headache every day for almost four months now, it kind of kind of changes the uh, the idea about you know the, what a concussion can do. Well, I mean, I knew it was a concussion right away, but it wasn't. I, I to be honest, is on that one at least. There's a short span where I just got knocked out. Like I didn't, I remember right before the hit, and then I remember getting helped up from the hit. So. In between, I don't remember that point, but I remember being on the sideline and knowing how bad my head hurt that it was a concussion. Even so, it was a wrenching decision not being able to lead the Sun Devils for a final season. It was, you know, it was over, it was a process, you know, it was a decision making process, but it was very difficult. Like I said, you know, it's, a, it's the most difficult decision that I've had to make to this point in my life. Uh, you know, football is a game I spent, you know, countless hours at, you know, since eighth grade. So, um, it was very difficult, but I just felt like it was the best decision. And although his days of suiting up as a Sun Devil are over, three is still sticking around to help the team. Well, I feel like I've invested a lot in the team. You know, I've been here for two years, and you know, I want I want us to be successful. I want Arizona State to be successful. Uh, same as last year. Last year, I, you know, I could help the team by being on the field. This year, I can't. So I'm gonna just try and find a way to help the team help the team win any way they can any way I can. What does the future look like for Stephen Three? And does it involve football in any way? Yeah, you know, it's possible. I'm not too sure yet. Uh, you know, this experience coaching, you know, will, will give me, shed a little light on, on that opportunity, but I also thought about, you know, grad school or some, some small business opportunities. Whatever his plans are, Three will never forget his time being a Sun Devil. It was obviously a great experience, you know, watching from the sidelines when I had to sit out the first year I was here uh, was difficult, but last year playing with the guys, you know, it, Season didn't turn out the way we wanted it to exactly, but uh, you know we were in a lot of games. Threat's new role may keep him on the sidelines, but he's still a part of the team, which is why he has trouble picking a favorite Sun Devil moment. I don't think I've seen it yet because I think this season is going to give a lot of memories. Um, yeah, personally, I think I think the best is yet to come.